Yeah, you know, I've got to be realistic about it. It's just hard not to be competitive. But the thing is, you know, I'm in my 20s. The mayor's taking me all over the world. And now she just gave me my first badminton completion. So I've got to be really happy with her. <laughs> Don't quite present all the time. <laughs> let's, um, let's talk about your summer plans because that's exciting. You've just been yeah. telling everyone you're going to be at Mike Winters with how many horses? Uh, hopefully, potentially five, you know, four to five. Um, you know, we've got uh, Doris is coming over to do Bramham, and then uh, Scarlett Lemulin, and then Bug. Um, you know, he didn't get to finish Kentucky because he pulled a muscle, but um, I, he's he's fine. So you know, hopefully Bug will come over. Uh, we kind of just have to make plans, but it would be exciting. Um, it's a great group of horses. My owners are so amazing and supportive about it that it just it's a really good opportunity to get a lot of experience over here with a group rather than just one horse. And summer is the best time to be here. Yeah, I, I'm not a fan of the cold. <laughs> I'll, I'll stick to Florida in the winter. So, um, you've completed badminton. Talk a little bit about you know what it felt like. Did you get used to it the more the longer you were here? And do you want to come back? When you come back, how will you approach it differently? Um, yeah, it certainly, you know, it, it, badminton takes a certain kind of horse, I think, um, with uh, Eric as the course designer. Uh, you know, they gotta just, I think it'll benefit those kind of really hardened older four star horses that, you know, they know how to fight for it and everything else. Um, but you know, it's, it's just something we have to keep experiencing and, you know, it's easy for everyone to get upset and Chris place blame on places when we don't get stuff done, but the same hand, we gotta keep throwing ourselves out here and, you know. When you live over here, you know nobody's following all those people when they're first getting their mileage over here and have, making mistakes and got, getting around. And you know, it's just a little perspective. You know, none of us take it lightly. We certainly we want to win. We're not just doing this for giggles. And <laughs> you know, we we want to get the job done and be competitive. But you know, uh, you know, experience is what you get after the fact. So you know, we're just trying to get that mileage and be competitive at the same time. And build stronger horses for the future you know I think a lot of us it's just a bit of a transitional phase and um, you know, I think everybody gets what needs to happen and you know the hard thing is we a little bit got these you know older seasoned horses that you know realistically aren't gonna beat uh, Michael or whatever else but we've also you know we've got these horses coming up that we're trying to get the mileage and experience that, that are the good have the ability to be the top of the game so it's all just you know we're trying to get the mileage we're trying to get the experience and we're trying to be competitive and so we're gonna make mistakes along the way but we're all trying to get it done well I think also it's exciting that uh, Donna and Veronica this morning looked like they could go around oh my gosh they were afternoon. so wild yeah I think God and Veronica and I think Lynn rode Donna this morning too and like we were just getting carted around they could have ran around again for sure so that's exciting. I think uh, Hannah Sue will be exciting at Lemulin. Absolutely, yeah. I think she'll be really competitive there. And, you know, that's one person when she's got a little bit of a chip on her shoulder, <laughs> she's definitely going to attack it. And, you know, she's she's going to do a clear out of Lemulin, whether, uh, you know, it's supposed to happen or not, she's going to make it happen. She's yeah. seriously competitive. And all three of you will be ones to watch. You'll have, you know, taken a lot away from this. I think it's been a great experience. It's been so much fun to watch you. You've been a it has been a privilege to talk to you every day and to learn from you. So thank you for letting us share your experience with you. We can't wait to watch you come back and we'll enjoy watching you all summer. Thank you.